So, you guys really love Star Wars. Stay tuned and I will explain why that is somewhat problematic. Welcome back. Now, over the past couple of months, I have been experiencing a great deal of growth on this channel, both in terms of numbers of views and numbers of subscribers, both of which is excellent news and I am extremely grateful for the support. However, it does come at a slight cost. Now, I'm going to go over some of these recent videos and show you the pattern that's developing and I will go into detail as to why, for me, this could indeed be quite problematic. So, looking at the last video I published, which was a video looking at the massive gentle giant vintage style Stormtrooper figure. It's been up for five days and already it's gotten 11,000 views, which for this channel is a big deal. Going back a little bit further, a couple of weeks ago, a video looking at the Stan Solo removable helmet vintage style Darth Vader, that's had 9,000 views. The video prior to that was the one where I was taking a close look at the vintage Kenner mini rigs that's had 10,000 views and going back just a little bit further, I did a video entitled Now I'm Finally Done Collecting Vintage Star Wars and that's had 5.5 thousand views. And in addition to those views have come a ton of new subscribers, which is great as I said earlier, but the problem is the channel is called All Things 80s, it's not All Things Star Wars. So these new subscribers are jumping on board expecting to hear nothing but Star Wars. And I just can't do that because in my opinion, the 80s was a wonderful time to be a kid. And yes, Star Wars was a big part of that, but it wasn't the only part. And there are many things to discuss from the 80s. And as a result of that, any time in the last few weeks that I've published a non-Star Wars video, they have completely bombed and I lose subscribers. So for example, a video I did, I think a week ago, or maybe even close to two weeks ago, it was looking at some never before seen photographs of some really big stars from the 1980s. Um, I thought it was a pretty interesting subject, a chance to see some never before seen photographs, but nope. That has managed 534 views. Um, another one I did I thought was interesting where I posed the question, should you buy a vintage toy complete or buy all the parts separately to make a complete one? And that has managed 633 views. Uh, I could go on and on. Uh, one that I found particularly hard to swallow was the video I did where I played back a 45-year-old audio cassette with all the voices of my family who are long gone. And I thought this was a really heartfelt video, something that people could relate to, but so far only 704 people have bothered to watch that. Clearly Star Wars sells. Now, in show business, you have to give them what they want. So. I will continue to make Star Wars videos, don't worry about that, but I am just asking, in addition to watching the Star Wars videos, please just watch the other stuff. We all grew up in the 80s, or most of us watching this channel grew up in the 80s, so pretty much everything I have to say should be relatable to the entire audience. And just remember, folks, there's more to life than Star Wars. Uh, I absolutely appreciate the support I've been getting, the subscriber count has just gone through the roof these past few months. It makes me very happy indeed, but I can't just do videos on Star Wars. So, you know, I'm just looking at this here. Even modern toys seems to get a lot of interest. So, for example, I looked at the NECA Batman 66 props, which were, quite frankly, pretty awful. That's a 2.1 thousand views. Um, where I asked the question regarding Hasbro's recent retro collection, which I think was um, Book of Boba Fett figures, I even forget now, I think that's had 5,000 views. Uh, people love 
they're Star Wars, I guess. Um, it's frustrating to an extent, but it's just a bit disheartening to know that unless it's Star Wars, people just aren't interested. But all I'm saying is, I do appreciate all you Star Wars fans tuning in and subscribing, but just take a few minutes out of your day to watch the other stuff I do, and I'm sure you will be able to relate to what I have to say, and you may even get some enjoyment out of it. So thank you for watching this little semi rant. Um, again, I need to stress, I am over the moon to get all these new subscribers and to get the view counts up. Um, just please watch it all. But as always, thank you all for watching this. Please leave a like, please share it. Make sure you are subscribed and stay tuned for more videos from All Things 80s.